y'all ever been to Dublin? Not the one in Ireland. Dublin, Texas. The one in Texas. You know us. You know we're swerving around Texas. So if we're going to Dublin, it's Dublin, Texas. Dublin's a little busy. They got some traffic. Let's see if we can slide in behind this car right here. Like a blackjack office center right here in front of us. And Bradbury's Blessings. We're going to make a left. And we're going to try to check out this old bottling company that used to be the Dr. Pepper bottling plant or the plant that bottled Dr. Pepper over here in Dublin and they used the real cane sugar they didn't use any of that high fructose corn syrup try to get a quick picture they've got a historical marker right over here Spin this camera. Dublin around. Dr. Pepper Bottling Company, Sam Houston Prime, 1863 to 1946, arrived in Dublin in 1891 with $680 worth of bottling equipment, purchasing property at the southeastern corner of Patrick and Elm Streets to house his bottling works. Prime bottled Dr. Pepper along with other products under an informal agreement until 1925, where he formally chose, a, uh, he was formally chose as Dr. Pepper's distri distribution. distribution territory, a 44 mile radius centered on Dublin, an era, area that remains as the company's territory today. At the time of Prime's death, Dr. Pepper executives noted he had bottled the soft drink longer than any other individual. The company has remained in operation since that time, making it the oldest Dr. Pepper bottler in the world. Nice. Y'all know me. I like a Dr. Pepper. I think I even got some on my wish list if y'all wanted to buy me a Dr. Pepper. If y'all ever wanted to buy me and Vanessa lunch or something, we do have a wish list down in the description. Y'all can throw a little money at us, buy us some lunch, and we'll give you a shout out and thank you while we're out making a video. We pretty much stop and have lunches and dinners and, you know, snacks out and about. It's a museum, man. It's right here on the Dublin corner. National Bank has a historic marker on the left. That one's There's a tattoo studio. Open. Got a little, little gathering spot, I guess. A little green space in the yep. middle of town. Yep, yep. Tea room. Mission time. Realty. The hospice care. The back porch. here and look at some of this uh, residential I guess right up here you gotta love all the old red bricks they go for a long way that road we just passed that red brick went all the way down that road let's go back to the red brick road this is a red brick ends right here 
I like the red brick roads. I think they're so cool. Well, you know that one's an old one, right? You can see the red brick. That's got to be an old road. Should have a bunch of old houses on it. Yep. Old houses and buildings. Yep, here it is. Red brick. Looked like it was pretty much as far as I could see. Oh, it is as far as I can see. It's not a one way, is it? Doesn't look like it. I can see red for a stop sign. Oh, yeah, there's a stop sign. We're good. It's got the preschool. Oh, what houses? That tire bike. We got half a brick road here. It's, that's probably as wide as it was back in the day. The red, red brick. They probably widened it. Oh no, there's more red brick under the paving. I guess they decided to pave over that part of it. This one's for sale. Nice. That's a nice one. The old church right there. This old stone one is empty. <laughs> Some really nice places. I knew all the old ones would be right here on the red brick road. There's an old stone Follow the yellow brick road. Over. Follow the yellow brick road. Let's follow the red brick road. Follow the red brick road. Oh, yeah, that one's cool. Wow. That's a big old porch. Big porch and the circle drive. I wonder, what is that? Is that a, part of a school? It looks like it might be the old school. Yeah. We were looking over to the right on the next road. Wow, it's big. Um, we're gonna go that way. I was gonna follow the red brick road, but we're gonna follow it to the right here. Dublin, Texas. What else you know about Dublin? We got some info? Let's see, what do we know? We've got a population of 3,426. So that's a good. median age of 33. Median age of 33. That's young. It's a young town. Per capita income is 29,000. Dublin High School. Wow. Wow. I guess this is the old high school because didn't we see a new high school? Yes, yeah, we, did see a we new saw high the school. new high school outside of town. This place is cool. Recreation, so that would have been the old gym. Wow. And that's awesome. And then they had like the. Look at that big place back there. Whoa. Oh, there it is. There's your skeleton. It's riding a dragon or something. Yeah. There's another one in the garage. And another dragon and a skeleton. Yeah, that is cool. You gotta get the mailbox. I am. Uh oh. Kitty, kitty. Hi, kitty. I just. She's trying to come get us. I wanna go find out what that building is back there. It looks like we need to go this way. It looked like we could go this way. Man. That's an old school. Really I like it. Really cool building. Looks like it's in good shape still. But that thing, what does it say? Dublin, Something Tyler? Tyler. Hugo, Oklahoma? Probably. Oh, it's like old uh, grain, or uh, old working part of town. Old, uh, wow. Wow. That's that cool. is so cool. All that old stonework. That's all stone. That is crazy. That's awesome. Let's see if you can get, oh, you think you can go down in front of it by the train tracks. I don't know. Wind up in their yard. I think it all connects over to all this. Yeah, it does. That 
basketball courts over here. Wow, All right. Like it's been around forever. And basketball yeah, courts. We'll have to make sure to get those on camera so we can show Camden. He's always pointing out the basketball courts. Yep. Oh, let's Look go at this old stone house. Let's go get the basketball goals. Oh, yeah, that's cool. The camera can't see it, though. Looks like they just moved this one here. What do you think? Did they that, just put that one there? Yeah, that one looks like they brought it in. Yeah. Pretty cool. There's the old school one across. Might be able to see it now. Maybe not, though. I forget. Are we pointing forward? What are y'all looking at? What are y'all looking at up there? Are you paying attention? Yeah, you're paying attention. Good job, guys. Check out the old basketball hoops. They got one full court, huh? One full court in the grass. Got some nets on them, surprisingly. It's surprising. Par partial nets, pieces of nets. Some picnic tables across the road. Got the old place here, Kitty in the road down there. Full stained glass. Well, we got distracted by that building, so I didn't yeah. finish the steps. What you got? So we're going to start over. Okay. We got the population with at 3,426 with median age of 33. We've got the per capita income at 29,456. The median household income is 45664 A little low. It's weird how sometimes a per capita is, I don't know, that. Sometimes, it, you know, most of the time it's like 20000 per capita, and that puts you at 40000 for the household, but sometimes it's just completely out of whack. Like that, you said 30,000, 29,000 basically, and then it was 40,000. wonder who Ben Hogan is. He's got a museum. Ben Hogan Museum? Oh, he's a golfer. He's a golfer. Um, we got a below poverty line is 29% or 23%. Home value is one hundred and thirty-seven thousand eight hundred. Huh, that's kind of high for the incomes. There's a, supposed to be a place around here we can buy some uh, Dr. Pepper. They closed down their touristy park of the plant, I guess, because they said the COVID kind of killed it. They they said back in the day they used to see over 100,000 tourists per year coming to check out the Dr. Pepper bottling plant. But um, within the last few years, they, they don't even see a thousand a year, I think is what they were saying. So they wound up closing down the tourist part of it. That's so sad. Look at this place. What is this? I don't know. Like that's water really department? cool. Like that was their old water bin, or maybe it's got a yeah, tower, a tower. On, on the top. That's my guess. Something to do with the water. Not that little house out back, like maybe a well house or water pump house. Or I don't know. Mm. The train depot. In front of us now. Is that what that is? I think so. 
That's what it Makes looks sense. like That's to me. That's the tracks right there. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure what that is. Insurance agency down there. Convenience store is closed, isn't it? Mm, got some muddy tires. Let's see what's down here. There's a Milano's Pizza. Them things are everywhere. Well, there's an old gas station. Oh, it's some more brick road, too. You got the family, family dollar and, and the dollar, dollar general. general. Trying to keep everybody alive over here in Dublin. Selling them all the stuff they don't need. Closed. He said, I'm open. There's, There's a little park. park. Not in very good shape. Definitely seen better days. This is the side of town the poor people live on in Dublin or what? Or just where all the industry is. So. There's Higginbotham Brothers. Higginbotham Brothers, them guys are everywhere. Benjamin Post, General Store, okay. Nelly. We're turning around. I think I've seen something interesting. Ready? Yes, so. Swerve. Swerve. Let's see. Let's see if it's interesting. Old convenience store there. It's closed down. That wasn't it, though. Look right here. What is that? What is that? I don't know. You're looking messed up, though. You're looking messed up. If I get some little trespass signs on it. Whatever Hopefully it our is, camera's still running. It is abandoned and vandalized. Abandoned and vandied. The vandals have arrived. Hey, kitty. Come here, kitty. I didn't even see that kitty, did you? I'm guessing we're in the housing authority. Anytime I see red yep. brick like this, that's my guess. Housing authority. Housing authority in the Shamrock Edition. Shamrock Edition. Yeah, we don't want to go to the Shamrock Edition, guys. Huh? Looks newer over there. You know, we don't like the new stuff. Our house is over a hundred years old. Why would we want to look at the new stuff? We like the old stuff. Howdy, 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 howdy. Howdy doody. Let's see. Looks like we can go to the right and get out of the housing authority here. Don't want to be violating the rules in the housing authority. Might get evicted. Yeah, good thing we don't live here. Man, this is big for a housing authority. It Maybe is. it's not housing authority. Maybe it's just rentals. I haven't actually seen a sign for this section. Maybe it's just duplexes. Somebody's making some money here. I don't know who it is, but somebody is. Yep, no signs. Crazy. East May. They have a ninja turtle in their in yard. Is that a kitty in the road? There's uh, a yes. kitty in the road. Right? And it looks like a dead end. I had a One of them. really big ninja turtle. A that, big ninja turtle? Yeah. Cool. So, no signs. Here's the office or something, though, right? It looks like an it looks office. Like, it looks like housing authority. See the little house symbol right there in the window? No. That's my guess. We should have went that way. This is a cool one. Is it? Mm -hmm. I got some... Lawn ornaments. All kinds of lawn decorations and okay. wall we're gonna, decorations. We're going to make the double U swerve, guys. Y'all ever seen that one before? That double U swerve. Well, there's a way to not have to Boy, that one's mow through. your yard. Turn it all into gravel. 
Yeah, that's that's what I want to do. Me too. <laughs> Rockscape. You yeah. know I would love it. I yeah. would I would not protest. We need some roofing done. Y'all still with us up there? Over here in Dublin, Texas, on the back roads. Let's see. Uh, you're still with us, but. Alright. Boy, this sucker's cold. Yeah. Magnetic mount. So, the only thing that we really need to do is figure out where to get one of them dang Dr. Peppers. One of them dang old bottled drinks. What do you think? What you think? You can have a doctor. You don't want no bottled drink? They got all kinds of bottled drinks. They, it's a bottling company. Yeah. You get you a bottled drink. I guess you already got some bottled drinks, huh? I've yeah. got some flavored water oh, yeah. and the juice. I think I drank all your flavored water. Come and drink it. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> See it? I like it. Come and drink it. Dublin, Texas root beer, craft soda. We gotta go find the store that's got this stuff for sale. Wayne's food. What's it say? Tipsy drinking something. Come and drink it, Dublin. Oh, that store's open over there, huh? Let's go over there. I thought that thing was closed. I just want to see if they got a drink in there. That's it. They got CBDs. Everybody got CBDs now. And they make all their drink coffees with Starbucks beans. They got beans? Starbucks coffee beans. I got, I got um, root beer, Texas Dublin, root beer. We got Dublin vanilla cream soda. We got Dublin vintage cola. I think I'm going to try the root beer first. What flavors do you get a root beer and what? Cream soda, a root beer, and I think the other one's just a cola. Yum. All of them sound really good. They do. The cream soda sounds cream soda really sounds good. good. Yeah. They had just a little little tiny cooler almost like a little mini fridge with a glass front in there with just the Dublin drinks I think they had one or two more that I didn't get these three jump kind of jumped out at me so we got three to try sorry about the reflection y'all we got you up in the window just for the outro we're gonna head on out of town <laughs> 